Welcome to our science project ideas. How to make a kaleidoscope. Learn how to make a kaleidoscope in this fun STEM science activity and craft for kids. It's such a fun way to explore light, reflections, and symmetry. Follow our science project ideas. Last week I made these super fun kaleidoscopes with my after school science class, which is composed of first and second graders. They loved exploring how their own designs reflected in the kaleidoscope such a fun STEAM activity for elementary students. Materials for homemade kaleidoscope Empty toilet paper roll Muller sheets, thicker sheets, not rolls of thin paper, or mirror sheets. Scissors and or paper cutter This is the paper cutter I keep at home. It's come in super handy. Tape White cardstock Bend the straw Markers, stickers, or other materials for decorating your spinning circle. Optional, paint for decorating your cardboard too. Directions for homemade kaleidoscope. First step. If you're planning on painting your cardboard tube, do that first. We use our favorite tempera paint. Set it aside to dry. Second step. Next, you need to cut your mylar sheets or mirror sheets into three equal strips. You want the size to be just right so the finished kaleidoscope insert fits snugly in your cardboard tube and won't fall out. We used cardboard tubes from an empty cotton L toilet paper roll. I'm not sure if different brands of toilet paper use different sizes of cardboard tubes, but these are the exact sizes that worked with our cotton L tubes. You might need to adjust yours depending on the size of your tube. Since you won't want to waste any mylar, practice sizing yours using cardstock first. We cut our mylar into strips that measured 9.7 cm into 3.5 cm. Third step. Line up your mylar strips, leave a tiny space between each one. Place the shiniest least scratched sides face down. Tape them together over the spaces. Fourth step. Fold the taped mylar into a triangular prism and tape along the top to hold in place. Fifth step. This should fit snugly inside your cardboard too. Sixth step. Cut off the beyond the end of a flexible straw. Seventh step. Tape it along the top of your tube with the flexible part of the straw hanging over the edge. Step 8. Cut out three circles from cardstock. Ours measure 3.75 inches in diameter. You can print out our free circle template to just make your own. Set 9. Decorate the circle using markers, stickers, crayons, etc. Try out different designs, shapes, and letters. Step 11. Place the circle onto your straw with the design facing the kaleidoscope. You want the hole to fit over the flexible portion of the straw so it will turn easily. Finally, look into your kaleidoscope and explore all the reflections created by your design. Tips. If you have trouble getting your triangular prism to fit snugly into your cardboard tube, it will work on its own. Simply tape the straw directly on top of the prism rather than using a tube. Make as many cardstock circles as you want and try them all out. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel.